big punch lands over the top. I was gonna follow this one. Tried to go to the body, but unable to connect. Well, he's doing a nice job here blocking these shots. The chin is tucked, the hands are high. Pretty good job defensively thus far. Great job defensively. He's seeing everything coming. Right, let's move now. Let's breathe and move. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with his leg kick. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. Beautiful technique on the straight right hand. Good defense to block the strike coming back. Big body kick land. He has a commitment to kicking tonight, and it shows. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. Nice strike. Big head kick land. Trying to establish that jab once again. Overhand lands. Whiffs on that offering. Strong kick to the outside of that lead leg for him there. You do not want to eat too many of those. No, you can't. He does not wind up on that kick, but he somehow is managing to land it with so much force. Oh, big diving punch lands up top. Well, there are a few things more fun to watch in mixed martial arts than these type of transitions and scrambles on the ground. High-level grappling can really be entertaining. All right, good job by him there to raise the guard and protect his head. He's doing a good job of keeping the guard high, locking his head, making sure he's not taking those damaging strikes up top. Connects with the right hand, pretty good punch that one. Nice right punch by this young man. Oh, there he goes, attacking that lead leg to the outside. Nasty kick there. Nasty leg kick. You gotta slow down your opponent. He knew his opponent wanted to move a lot tonight. This is the first step in getting him to slow down and fight at your pace. Oh! Oh, straight right! Oh! Dude's first. All right, so inside the open guard of his opponent. Got to be careful playing around for too long here on the ground with this guy. Every time these guys come together, man, you just hear the punches and everything landing. Both, both very powerful, very, very explosive. Ooh, head kick lands. It's hurt. All right, so there's the end of the round as we show you some of the highlights, DC. And there was a big knockdown there. Thought he might get the finish. We'll see if he gets it in the next round. Well, if he lands that shot again, if he lands that shot again, it will be over. It will be a finish. You don't recover from two of those types of strikes. He found the right moment. He found the opening and landed that big shot. You ready to fight? Ready. Second round underway. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Oh, man, his leg kicks are outstanding, and you saw a great example of that just there. And you see his opponent starting to slow down. He cannot take many of those kicks. Really timing his shots nicely. Good tempo, very accurate, finding the range with relative ease. Yeah, he's doing a great job of really overwhelming his opponent with activity. It's very tricky when he throws that body kick. What a punch. Just missed with the elbow there. Oh! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Trying to stay in this fight!
held up. But you do not want to be on the receiving end of those types of strikes. Well, you see all the grappling repetitions here. Just beautiful movement, seamless transitions on the ground. Over and over, these guys are doing things that you see in every jujitsu gym. Oh! He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Big knee to the body. Way to hide that leg kick. His opponent in a world of trouble. Such a sneaky head kick he did not recognize it. Was super high, and now he's got him hurt bad. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Liddell gets touched by that kick there. This is a great fight. Oh, tagged him with that right hand. What a strike that was. What a strike that he's landing over and over again. His opponent will need to make some adjustments. Well, at this point, he's got to be way up on the judges' scorecards. Clearly winning the fight and largely has gotten it done with his striking team. He's got it done with his strike. That one appeared to stun him. Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Back to the feet. All right, well, looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. So a good job defensively by him here as he raises the guard and prevents any damage. Shades of James Tony, always seeing things coming at him. He's such a great defensive fighter. He missed with that jab attempt. Well, he's really starting to land a high number of strikes here in the second round. No denying that he has taken the message from his corner and picked up the pace here in round two. Beautiful kick. Drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body kick. Now the guy's got on bar. He's attacking it on him. Dell's head kick is blocked, so no damage inflicted there. Straight right hand now just misses. Big kick. Down for next. So the crowd voicing its appreciation after that round. We had a knockdown courtesy of a punch midway through. DC, here's your highlight. It was straight. He threw him in combination and landed that big punch that really did hurt his opponent. Lesser men would have been done. He's got a tough guy in front of him. He will have to go back to this again. He will have to get back to this action if he wants to get the desired finish. You ready to fight? Ready. Third round underway. Dell's kick is blocked. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Look at the angle of that nice body kick. Oh, trying to turn out the lights for that roundhouse kick, but just misses. 
Punch is blocked. Ooh, what a punch. Outstanding kick there by the Hall of Famer, the Iceman. Now his opponent's really on the ropes. His opponent's on Beach Street. He's hurt so bad. I don't know what he's going to do to stay in this fight. He does everything so well. And he's so tall. So tall to face such a big spot. Back and forth we go. Oh! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves it. Trouble. He's getting lit up. Oh! Oh, he's hurt. He's hurt away. Back. Well, he continues to land a high. He's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Now look at him jumping in to try to get the finish. A lot of top pressure being applied here. All right, he's trying to control posture here. Now trying to hip escape. He's just trying to move out of this position up the bottom. Oh, he got him. He got him. Oh, he's got the ground and pound going now. Under three minutes remain in round three. Liddell's uppercut is plus. Looked like for a minute he had a window there. It closed quickly. Results in the KO here tonight. All right, let's get you some replays now. Certainly a lot for our replay guys to work with in the truck. This was a clinic tonight in terms of mixed martial arts acumen in every realm of the game. A full-on display of all of his skills. He did everything in this championship winning performance. He used his wrestling. He used his elbows. He used his pace and pressure to really wear down his opponent so that he can get his hand raised. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean is going to stop in this contest at 2 minutes, 36 seconds of round number 3. Declaring the winner by knockout, Chuck the Iceman Liddell! All right, so there he is, the man of the moment, celebrating one of the bigger knockout victories.